Delhi has joined the list of states seeking a continuation of the lockdown in order to contain the coronavirus pandemic. Punjab had yesterday extended lockdown to May 1st and before that, Odisha has announced similar measures. COVID-19 cases in India have crossed 7,000 with 239 deaths reported. India witnessed the highest number of fresh cases since the outbreak began here. 1,000 new cases were reported in 24 hours. The Indian Health Ministry, however, still maintains that there is no community spread in the country, only cluster outbreaks. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on Saturday held a video conference with chief ministers of all states and union territories to discuss the next course of action when the 21-day lockdown is set to lift and whether it should be lifted on April 14th as decided. Prime Minister Modi and other ministers were seen wearing homemade masks during the call. A Karnataka BJP MLA threw a mega party for his birthday where hundreds of supporters were invited amid a nationwide lockdown. M. Jayaram, the legislator from Tiruvekkere in Karnataka's Tumakuru district, served biryani to guests and cut a large chocolate cake wearing gloves. This is not the first time that Karnataka politicians have defied lockdown orders. India on Saturday reacted strongly to the United Nations call for the government to fight stigmatization of certain sects of people. An Indian representative to the body said the remark was highly objectionable as such matters are being looked after by the government, enlightened citizens and the civil society in the country. J.S. Rajput, India's representative in the UNESCO Executive Board, said that UN agencies, particularly in the context of India, are indulging in issues that are not the part of their international responsibilities. The Indian industry has a plan for resumption of economic activity through pooled testing. By this method, a group of workers' nose and throat swaps can be taken using specified procedures in a buffer solution which can then be tested for COVID-19. This will reduce need for individual testing amid shortage of kits. If the batch of combined samples tests negative, then the group can be permitted to work. In case of a positive result, individual testing should be done. The positive sample can then be identified within 4-12 to 12 hours. The Indian Council of Medical Research has written to 13 medical institutions of eminence across the country to act as mentors in the process of increasing testing for COVID-19 in states. These institutions are expected to serve as mentors of the medical colleges in their catchment areas and facilitate the establishment of COVID-19 testing facilities in their respective states. France has reported 43 cases of heart incidents linked to treating coronavirus patients with hydroxychloroquine, the malaria drug that US President Donald Trump has repeatedly touted as a potential game-changer. Meanwhile, many countries have placed an order for this drug from India and the government is set to ship the quote-unquote essential drug to 13 countries in the first consignment.